writer is the one thing that I know has been doing that for a lots and lots of people. So this is the Evie Rider Easy Move Folding Travel Scooter. This one, particularly this one, has been one of our most popular Evie Rider models because of the fact that it only weighs about 45 pounds and it's super, super easy to maneuver. It's $1,999.80. Your five easy payments on this, $399.96. You're saving almost $40 off on free shipping and handling. It is an absolute considered purchase. Take advantage and get this one on a cue card. A lot of people, when they're shopping at QVC with a considered purchase, they use this opportunity to get a cue card. Why? Because with this, you can take advantage and pay this off over 18 months. You get 18 special months, um, 18 months special financing on this. So what does that mean? Those payments now go from a five easy payments of $399.96 to $111, interest-free, by the way, as long as those payments are made on time and every month. So what a great way to go to your siblings to say, hey, I see mom slowing down a little bit. Something's different with her since she stopped driving. What can we do to make sure that she feels included in going to the kids' recital, walking the kids to the park, just included in life, this is how you do it. You get her an EV Rider. We do have it in four colors. I have it here in the red. We have three other colors that you can shop for as well. Red usually is always a really fun one and very, very popular. We have it in blue. We also have it in copper. And in purple. So... Um, the item number is V36944. I am always really excited, and I'm really happy that she's spending a little time with me on Easter morning, Miss Denise Repco, who is one of our fitness and health um, experts here at the Q. Denise, always Hi, good to Monica. see you. Hi, good happy Easter. Happy Easter to you, and there's no one else I'd rather be working with on oh, Easter than you. so sweet. <laughs> you know, oh, um, you. I think particularly today, I feel like today is kind of that unofficial, and I posted this to my Instagram this morning, it's kind of that unofficial holiday season where mm. we're finally starting Kicks to get off. together, right? Easter, Passover, yeah. it's that time yeah. where we go, okay, let's get together, let's spend quality time together as a family. And so when I thought about that this morning with the EV writer, I said, I wonder who's that family member that's sitting on the sidelines mm, because yeah. they feel like they can't do that because maybe their legs are a little bit unsteady. Maybe they right. feel like they're a burden to be able to ask their family and mm -hmm. friends to be able to help them out. No, not with this. Yeah. Well, if they're sitting on the sidelines at home, that's one thing. But yeah. with this, you can literally sit on the sidelines for the kids' game, yeah. right? You can go to the soccer game, the softball game, the football game, whatever it is, and really watch those kids or watch those grandkids in person. Yeah. And what I love about this scooter is this comes to your home fully assembled out of the box, and it folds one, two, three, unfolds, one, two, three. You don't have to take any parts off or add any parts on. All you have to do is put the seat back down and on every scooter, there's a red pedal that says press on it at mm -hmm. the bottom left portion of the base. So you put some pressure on it, press it. It allows you to fold your scooter in half. It now locks into place in this position and you can upright it. There's a handle. So now you can push it to maybe take it to your car if you're going on a trip somewhere or storing it away in a closet or a garage. When you go to unfold it, same three simple steps, just in reverse. So you'll hit that lever, that's one. Open it up is, and two, now this is the most important step, this yep. step two, because you're gonna push and pull simultaneously. And when you hear that click, you know your base is engaged. Step three, you put the seat up. Now, where is it you wanna go? Yeah. It's that easy. You know, I think that's so great. Mother's Day is coming up. Um, all the brunches, people are going to their places of yeah. worship today. And um, you know, when I was coming here, a place was getting out and it was super early. I was like, oh, they're gonna have a great day with their family today. Uh -huh. Everybody's gonna be going to brunch and all of that. And maybe you wanted to go, but again, you just felt like, uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to really do that. I, I won't be able to walk that distance, you know, to get mm -hmm. to that to that restaurant. No, you get an EV rider and it puts you back into enjoying life, exactly. enjoying those family and friends. I can't tell you, Denise, and we've talked about this a many a time. When I see people on their EV riders, you know, if 
I go, good for you. Good for you, because you've chosen yeah. to go on this cruise with your family. You've chosen mm -hmm. to go to the happiest place on earth with your family. And now you can do all of those things and still create those memories just by simply getting an EV rider. And I know a lot of times, you know, um, siblings will get this for their parents because maybe sometimes the parents don't really want to admit they need a little mm -hmm. help. Mm -hmm. So it's really a great thing for that. It really is, and that's what my siblings did for my dad. I happened to be the oldest of seven, and my dad started pulling back from doing things, and honestly, he didn't want a scooter, and there, there's a picture of dad, and that was just this fall. Dad comes over to the house, watches the Eagles games. I go to his house sometimes with my parents. I will be going to their house right when we're through today. See, yeah. But, but this gets him up and out and moving, and he feels independent. He doesn't have to feel like he's asking for help or being babysat. But my siblings chipped in and you know got this for him, and now independence is at his fingertips. Uh, he still does drive his car, but this goes in. It only weighs 45 pounds. Yeah. It doesn't take any special vehicle. And all he has to do is fold it, put it in, unfold it, and go. So it really does um, make it easy and effortless. And he can go and do things on his own. He doesn't have to ask for help yeah. or say, hey, hey, can you come pick me up? Right. Or can you take me to the... He just goes on his own, yeah. and that's the independence that EV Rider brings to so many people for a myriad of reasons, whether it's weak knees, weak back, right. a new surgery, expectant mom, maybe people get short of breath. Whatever your reason is, you don't have to say no. Because oh, yeah. if it's walking... This gets you there, and you got a comfortable seat always. Right. Let's do a quick tour of it. I know you showed okay. how we fold it and how mm -hmm. easy that is to fold and unfold. Like, literally, that's what makes this model. Super easy. Yeah, people love it because it's just that easy one, and it's 45 mm -hmm. pounds, so it's not terribly heavy. But it's easy to operate, too. When we talk yeah. about, look at this control panel. I know it's upside down. Maybe I should have turned around. But it's upside down here. But um, it's three buttons here and this is your key so i mean let's talk about this denise this is simple it's super simple and again when you get this home fully assembled out of the box we give you two keys you put the key in you turn it to the right and instantly and even the first day you get it home lights will come on because we put some charge in the battery and that battery display as those lights go dark that's a visual safety feature built in to let you know you have to start thinking about charging all of the dashboard elements are listed with icons, so there's no guesswork. You see a horn where your horn is. You see a light where your headlights and tail lights are. It's a rocker switch there in the center. And then your speed dial is just a simple twist, clockwise, counterclockwise. <laughs> and then you have a dual throttle system, so that little red lever at the top right and then the black one on the left Dual throttle means they go forward and backward with just a little push of just the tip of your finger. And then if you only want to have a, a strong left hand or a dominant left hand, it works one handed as well. You can work it on the left or the right. And the best part is you don't have to worry about remembering where a brake is, right. knowing how much pressure to apply or squeeze, because all you have to do is let go. And that's called an electromagnetic braking system. So when you let go of the throttle, you're coming to a smooth, steady, comfortable, and always yeah. in control stop. I'm gonna start writing around a little bit just to demonstrate <laughs> that too, because it's sure. so easy. Um, you just kind of go, and again, look, it goes over all the surfaces. I'm all, all mm -hmm. going over carpet, right? I'm going slow yeah. on purpose, just so you can see. And then when you wanna stop, you just stop. And that's yeah. it, it's this nice, smooth glide. So you don't have to worry about like jerking or you know a crazy kind of stop or finding a lever to hit when you wanna break. No, you just let go and it'll stop. But what's nice about this one too is that it comes with that charger. How long mm -hmm. on a full charge will I get with this one, Denise? Yeah, great questions. Full charge will bring you nine miles or two hours of continuous use we say so this is the charger that comes with your scooter it's got one end that goes into the scooter one end that goes into the wall when you plug this in for four to six hours it uh, only goes in one way so you can't plug it in incorrectly i love that because if you ever plug something in and then realize it wasn't quite connected right and then you have to do it all over again that's not going to happen here. And then Regular we have the car charger source. really quick. Just oh, so yeah. it's on the screen. So if you want to shop for mm -hmm. the car charger, it's there as well. So that's a nice little accessory that you can pick up for this too. Right. And the car charger means you plug it right into your car. So if you're going on a trip and you don't have your scooter charged, you could be charging it while you're driving to nice. that destination. So that makes it easy. It is an additional purchase. When this is charging, one cool thing, another thing I love is there's an indicator light. It seems like a simple thing, but that indicator light is red. While it's charging, 
turns green when it's fully charged. So you don't have to remember what time did I plug it in? Has it been three hours? Has it been two hours? This will turn green when it's fully ready. Now, this holds up, up, up to a 250 pound person. So if you're coming in at 250 and you're riding this throughout the day with a lot of hills, you might get eight miles out of a full charge. I'm about 125 pounds, five foot two. If I'm on flat terrain, I may even get 10 miles. But I just encourage people, if you're out and about, yeah. keep this at the ready, keep it in your pocketbook or your book bag, so that if you are running low on power, find a coffee shop, find lunch, and just top it off so you can get through your day. And then if you do use this every day, just get in the habit of charging it overnight all the time. So it's always there for you and it's always ready. Yeah, that's nice. You know, um, as I am sitting here getting ready to ride on this, I think about all the places that you can go. Mm. What are the different terrains that you can go over? We talked a bit, little bit about like I went over this rug. Obviously, I'm mm -hmm. on hardwood. But if I go outside, is there something yeah. that the EV rider cannot go over? You will take this everywhere. You would take a baby stroller, a wheelchair, or a bicycle. So this would rule out sand. You wouldn't take it on the beach, but you could sure enjoy the boardwalk nice. or the strand. So only you know sand or maybe some like fine loose gravel. But honestly, this goes wonderful over your your cobblestone, your pavers, your sidewalk, your driveway. This is not for on the road. This is not a licensed vehicle but it can take you in your parking lots and to your destinations where you know those are long walks or you're in those happy greatest places on earth. Meet friends for lunch, go to a cafe, go to a movie. You have a little bit of adjustability in the tiller, so if you have someone with longer legs, you can give them more room or a little more petite person, you can lower that steering column down to make it more accessible and it only weighs 45 pounds. So you Love put that. it in any trunk, truck, car, SUV. I've said it many times, I only have a four-door sedan and I find it much easier to lift this into the back seat of my car than lifting it higher into the trunk. But right. it fits um, in any four-door. Yeah. I wanted to show you, because you're talking about where you can go with this. Yes. What I love about it is this is indoors, yes. It's outdoors, yes. But it's also TSA cleared, which means you drive this through the airport, down to that farthest gate, G29 or B29. Right. And, right, and then all the way down the jetway. So that little tunnel that leads to the door of the airplane, you drive it right there, take out your keys, and you'll do this. One, two, three. Nice. The flight attendant or security will put that underneath of the plane, and when the plane lands, they'll bring it to you. But I just wanted to show you how compact. Sometimes people think, well, is it too big? Is it too bulky? Is this gonna be in the way? No way, because this is a 29-inch piece of luggage, pretty much your larger size piece of luggage that you would check at the at the airport. You know, the one that weighs 50 pounds yep. or more, and you got to pull your stuff out so you don't have to pay extra. But this is what this looks like in its folded position. So really, truly compact and gets you to the big oh places. Oh, my gosh. Gets you to the little places yeah. when you unfold it and that plane lands. Here's what you do. You've got your keys in your pocket and now you're off and going to that happy place, wherever it is. Right. You're just off and right. So no calling security. Right. No getting a Waiting. wheelchair to come yeah. get you. Right. You know, I, when you talk about going to the airport, first of all, I always say if you're going to uh, take any kind of equipment, just call the airport or the airline just so they, you know, you can let them know that you're going to be having your EV rider or whatever. Like, I mean, even I, I think I had to do that one time with like a wheelchair or something. So it's really mm -hmm. nice to let them know that you're coming. But... Think about what you're gonna be able to do. My mom's um, best friend, um, I remember seeing pictures of her. She and her grandkids and her family, they went to the happiest place on earth. And guess how she was able to get around that park? Mm -hmm. On her mm -hmm. scooter. Now, I am telling her, you should probably go ahead and get you an EV rider because when you rent those things, oh, dear, they no. are disgusting. I had to rent one, I, and I just thought about this, Denise, I don't even think I've told you this story. I had um, a procedure done on my hip a few years ago, oh, 10 years ago now, it's been like okay. 10 years ago. And then of course you can't walk, so you have to use mm -hmm. the crutches. But I remember going to the grocery store, I was ca having cabin fever and I was ready to get out. Yeah. And so I remember going to the grocery store and getting on the one in the grocery store. Now, I have always been, even before these last three years happened, I've always been the type to wipe everything down. Oh, good. I good. couldn't wipe it down enough. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? I couldn't 
wipe it down enough at the grocery I store. I, I say that all the time to people. I mean, I, I don't mean to be a germaphobe either, but you know, it's important. And I have never seen the big box store, grocery store carts being wiped down. Maybe they are, but they don't, they don't look like they are. When you have your own, it's, 